I'm on the hunt for the best Easter cookies, cakes, and everything Easter in downtown Catania, and I think I found the best of the best. Catania's got very distinctive uh, pastries, and Esther did a wonderful job giving you a great idea of what is there for this season. And also lunch goodies, too. Yes, yeah, it's great. Let's okay. go. Let's go take a look. I'm walking by and I smell something so delicious. And here they are baking the Colombo cake. Che sono questo? Baba. Baba. Torta de baba. I can't believe I just they just let me in here. <laughs> Look at this beautiful. Oh, cudura. Cudura de uva. Look at the little ones. This place is masters over here. Look at this, beautiful. Lui maestro. Signor Pippo, buongiorno. Ho sentito tante, tante cose. Grazie, grazie. Sì. Oh, this is such a treat. I've heard so much about this guy. This place is famous. È una famoso questa. And these are the desserts that he makes. Agnellino Pasquale, di pasta marzapane. Con la marzipane. E questa, mi spiega, questa. Questo è il uovo, l'uovo di gallina con biscotto, che si chiama Cicilio. Cicilio. No, cotto. Cotto. È infornato. E come chiama ancora? Cicilio. E da quanti anni sta facendo? Da tanti, tantissimi anni. Biscotto dopo invornare. Sì. Bellissimo. Tanti, tanti anni. E altra specialità per questo periodo? Sì, queste. Adoro. Queste sono... Queste si chiama cuore esimale. Cuore esimale. E dentro? Dentro c'è frutta candita, mandorle, zucchero, farina. Candy fruit, almond, frutta flour, candita a pezzettini, zucchero, farina, mandorle. Pieces. Poi ci sono le pavarelle. Quindi le pavarelle. Questa? Quelle, quelle. quelle sono Look how per, per Pasqua. Okay. Wow, bellissimo. Grazie a tutti. This must be his team here. Oh, he wants to put his hat on. This is such a treat. We're going to be shown the place by the maestro. Maestro, <gasps> Look, this is it's made right here. And this is what it looks like. Primo de forno. Prima de forno. Sì. And this looks like it has uh, arancia. Si? Yes, si. 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 Classica. 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 Nulla di dentro non c'è nulla. Dentro non c'è niente. No. There's solo, nothing solo inside. Solo buccia d'arancia. Verona e Bonvegna. Verona is on the left. Bonvegna is on the right. Da 70. 70. 50 years old. Loro hanno aperto nel 70, ma io sono arrivato nel 78 qua, avevo, avevo 15 anni, c'erano 60 15 quindi. years old when he came here first. He's <laughs> been here for 45 years. Wow, veramente complimenti. He's insisting that I have one sweet. Puoi salutare tutti il mondo. Ciao a tutti. Buona Pasqua. Buona Pasqua a tutti. Da tutti. Right. Happy Easter from everyone. Un'altra domanda. Perché fai questo lavoro? Perché mi scorre nel sangue. Da piccolissimo. Sì? Certo. He's been doing this since he was a young kid. It's in his blood. Veramente, veramente tanti auguri Grazie, a auguri tutti. Grazie, auguri a tutti. Grazie. Tutti a voi. Auguri. Non c'è questa Verona, non c'è. Sì, c'è anche la pagina di Verona e Bonfè. C'è la pagina. Ok, sì, so la they, puoi mandare lì. They do have a Facebook page and it's called Verona e Bonvegna. E Bonvegna. When you're in Catania, come here. Sì. Grazie. This is a typical lunch place for the Catania workers of this area. 
no tourists here. They're all locals. They're all coming here for lunch. So all the local workers come here at lunch and this is some of the selection that they have here. Ciao, buongiorno. Ciao. And even here there's Easter. Saluta a tutti. Direttrice. Laura Schivignano. Laura Schivignano. E tu, come ti chiami? Luigi Rizzo. Luigi, what a beautiful name. So, there Lui is your Giuseppe lunch. Drink. Oh. Giuseppe Drink. Oh, Giuseppe Drink. Giuseppe, let's Giuseppe see who Giuseppe Drink. is. He's hiding behind oh, there. <laughs> and then here are some of the Easter things. And up top as well. And so people from all over Catania come here for lunch. It's about 1 o'clock. No, 1.30. Here's another shop, and the Colombo cakes are made here as well, but I wanted to show you this pizza right here. A maravilla, look at this, with, with walnuts. Now that I have never seen. Pizza with walnut and bacon, it looks like pancetta. What's a pancetta, senora? With pancetta, look at that. What do you think? And these sticks, these bread sticks with all types of fillings, spinach, cheese. That is very cool. And here's the other pizzas that look pretty darn good. And here's the famous Sicilian pizza with yes, a hot dog and patata frita. She even has some focaccio. Busy scene here for lunch, of course. All right, this is also very particular. She's got all types of muffins. There's the cannoli. Since 1845, love it. Oh, I love those. Those are the spinach and also the onion. I just came in here and I said, please, can I register? Can I film this beautiful flower presentation here? So I said, no problem, I'll put the light on. Bellissimo. Complimenti. Thank you very much. <laughs> Buona Pasqua. Buona Pasqua. <laughs> he said before, Happy Esther, and I said, No, Esther is my no, name. Yes, he's Happy different. Easter. Happy Easter. Filippo. See? Filippo, yes, my name is Filippo. Cettina. Cettina. Valentina. And Valentina, and the name of the store is? It's Churi and Muri. That's in, in Sicilian. In English, it's Flower and Love. Beautiful. And I want to show you this, because they have the Testa de Moro. From Caltagirone, but look at the presentation, okay? The colors, just beautiful. Grazie mille. Buona Pasqua. Buona Pasqua. Look at this. Look what she gave me. Grazie, gentilissimi. Look at that. And he's recording this. This is so beautiful. I love my job. Ciao. <laughs> ciao, ciao. <laughs> I have to tell you guys, my heart is so warm and happy, not just because it's a beautiful day, but I'm meeting all these cool people. And there's just something so alive about Catania that I just love coming here. I'm on a mission to find the best Easter goodies. Hey, I wanna know from you guys, so far, which place did you like? There's the classic, the chocolate, and the pistachio. And in this store, they're just putting out the Easter goodies. This is interesting. This is chocolate eggs with different flavors. There's the pistachio, the almond, 
chocolate. Great presentation. Okay, they do have Lynn here. Gift basket with a Columba cake. Here's the marzipan, dolce crema, and some more Easter eggs from the famous Italian Bacci. Everyone has their own type of Columba. It's probably hundreds of Columba cake types. You may remember I did one on Fiascanato in Castel Buono. They make both panettone and Columba cake. The Codura di Ova. There's the marzipan lamb that is very popular in this period. Now this is what really caught my eye. These very cool eggs. Very creative here. Look what I found. Cordura. La cordura siciliana. Acerdo con l'ou. With the egg in the middle. E perché è speciale qui in Sicilia? È una tradizione che facciamo, che facciamo annualmente. È una tradizione siciliana che si tramanda. Solo questo periodo di Pasqua. Only for Pasqua. Colomba. Colomba. Colomba Pasquale. Look at that. Colomba Pasquale because it's shaped it's like a dove. And look at this. They have the orange. Arancia e poi pistacchio. What I love to see is each one of the shops has their own specialty. Actually, this one is very popular. The cipollini has the onions in there. But that looks very interesting. Oh, bolognese. And then you have the cornetti and the pasta and the rice. The arancini. Cartocciata, that has potatoes and hot dogs. Bomba al forno with pomodoro and mozzarella. That does look like a bomb, I'll be quite honest with you. E salute a tutti. Arrivederci. Come a te presto. Io sono Denise. Denise, ciao. So in the end, I've got a big bag of cookies, which I'm going to show you in just a little bit. He was even going to give me more, and I said, no, 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 it's too much. Thank you so much. Then I got a flower. I got a cup of coffee, and that's all for walking around and highlighting the treasures of Sicily. Well, this shop looks... Very cute. I think I'm gonna go in. Giorno. Oh, look at these. So cute. Now that's quite a collection of eggs. Very unusual. That Antica Dolceria, Buon Aiuto, is also in Modica, so she, this is a famous shop. Lots and lots of Easter goodies here. Here are the famous Modica chocolates. Of course, we've done an entire episode on Modica and how these chocolates are made. It's like I like to say it's an acquired taste. You either like it or you don't. But no one can argue that it's very special. Una cassetta del genere in ceramica che resta questa e gli mettiamo qualcosa sopra. C'è questo qua. Saluta a tutti per Pasqua. Ciao a tutti e buona Pasqua a tutti. Ciao. Ciao e auguri. Grazie a te, ciao. And this is the store. Gloria Condorelli. Now I'm sitting in a park waiting for my friend Vanessa to finish her haircut. And someone's car just got broken into. So this is Catania for you. Never know what's going to happen. And 
we did yoga this morning and then she came to do her haircut and then I said, oh, I'm gonna come and find as much about Easter here in downtown Catania. Salute a tutti. Ciao. Prego. What caught my eyes over here are these panettones. And look at the beautiful decoration. Look how they're decorated. Questa da de dove sono? Queste sono panettoni di giarre della Sicilia. Giarre. Sì. Ti. Ciao, e ciao. per Pasqua che sono cose speciali? In cose Sicilia. speciali abbiamo le colombe artigianali antica Sicilia che sono eccezionali, nostra produzione. Abbiamo crema di mandorla, crema al mandarino, crema al pistacchio e crema al cioccolato. Polyphemus, questo è Polyphemus, vero? Il nostro cavallo di battaglia, marmellate siciliane, terre nere. Salami. Questa è grappa? Sì, sì grappa, grappa sempre siciliana. E altre cose speciali per... Uh... Io sono speciale. <laughs> It certainly is special. E per Pasqua? Uh... Cose speciali per Pasqua abbiamo questa provola. Idea regalo per Pasqua. Ideal gift for Pasqua. Siciliana. Buono. E questa da dove? Castiglione di Sicilia. Uh, bella, Fuletna. Sì, Fuletna. Grazie mille. Grazie a voi. Ciao. Ciao, a presto. Ciao. Ciao, veniteci a trovare. Condorelli is probably one of the biggest Sicilian names as well. This guy at the hairdresser. <laughs> Mr. Rabbit. Now I gotta tell you, so that first store that I showed you is one of the most famous uh, pastry shops in downtown Catania. And I walked by it first because Vanessa told me to go there and was closed. And on the way back, walked past it and I smelled that wonderful Columba cake being uh, baked and it just literally pulled me inside but what a treat to get to go inside of there and look at the goodies that they made me here's you saw this cookie I forgot the name of it and then here's the almond pasta de, pasta de almond and here's another cookie so that was gifted to me by yeah. the beautiful people of Verona and Verona and, Verona and Borbegna. And which street is there? Are they on? They are on Via Assaggio, and that is really near to Corso Italia. So and what a treat! The one bad thing about this, though, uh, is that uh, after the show, <laughs> is that unfortunately, or fortunately, someone has got to tackle those things and give a critical analysis. Okay, time. I think you're going to be the <laughs> man for that. It's after the show. You can try it. Oh my goodness. Yum. That good, huh? Oh. <laughs> this is a great cookie. And my biggest regret is there's only two others. Let me tell you, I had so much fun walking around, meeting new people. Everyone was so friendly and uh, just very generous. Very much enjoyed my morning slash afternoon in Catania. And those are places, by the way, not far from uh, the touristy, you know, the uh, touristy place where Vietnam and so forth that we take you all the time. I think Catania and Messina both of them have the best assortment of uh, baked baked stuff, torts, uh, yeah. cookies and stuff, in all of Sicily. Seriously unbelievable. Oh, I hope someone listening in other parts of Sicily are going to be like, No, the scene is just unbelievable. Well, you know, everywhere. I have to take you up there now one day me, just to eat that stuff. It's great. Kudura de Ova. Let me just talk about Kudur, that, okay? I kept Kudura. saying Kudura because I was in the hunt because... We are watching this, if you're watching this live, you're watching this on Palm Sunday. Happy Palm Sunday. And uh, a lot of the Easter things were just coming out. And I was looking for a Kudura de Uva. What is a Kudura? Kudura is a Greek name. It's mainly uh, known in southern Italy and uh, Sicily. And th there are several translations. Calabria. Calabria, Calabria yep. Yeah. Uh, several translations. Braided, crown, loaf of bread. But it's basically a biscotti or a bread with an egg in the middle. And 
Hard boiled egg. Hard boiled egg, exactly. And what and you saw? Symbol, and the symbol is, is really about, um, the egg is a symbol of Christianity, and I don't want to go too much into it, but it is a very important symbol here, in Sicily especially. But what we saw at the shop was not a cordura, because that egg, if correct me if I'm wrong now, is baked along with the, the uh, biscotti batter in the oven. Hey, is there someone you want to wish a happy birthday to? What well, a big shout out today to my pal Peter Schipoletti. It's his birthday yesterday. Oh, goody. Okay, and of course uh, we talk about Peter, we brag about Peter. He's probably the most knowledgeable guy about tomatoes. Yep. In the United States of America. This guy is a tomato whiz. Happy birthday, Peter. Happy birthday, oh, goody. All right, today is Palm Sunday, and when you're watching this, Alfred and I are down in Achitraza because we're going to record some video of the palm and some of the procession. So we'll be bringing you that video sometime this uh, midweek, I think. Out of all the places I go to, I like to go to Achi Threats. I've been there a bazillion times. And unfortunately, next Friday, I love to go to Anna, but we can't go to Anna for the uh, Good Friday possession. But we have a video on it, don't we, Esther? We certainly do. And we're going to put that up, that Esther, uh, Easter Good Friday possession. possession is terrific. I, ha I understand that a one that's almost as good or probably even better is the one in Shaka. Yes. So, anyways, it's this season. By the way, today it's 73 degrees out, and that's the Saiyan sun was just beating down on me this morning, and I really felt for the first time that it's, winter is over. It's Believe beginning me. to feel a lot like yeah. spring here yeah. in Sicily, so it's wonderful. If yeah. you're watching this, uh, our June tour is still open, and if you're watching this right now, before June 6th, we're giving $250 off per person for first-time travelers. First-time travelers of you, me, and Sicily. June 6th to 16th. We have four, four spaces left in the June trip. Where yep. are we going in June, anyways? Palermo. Palermo. Uh, we're going to be based out of Castellamare del Toro. Castellamare del Toro. Suggest uh, we're going to go down to Shaka, San Vitolo Capo, and Trapani, the city of Trapani. So lots of beautiful places. And also some room left in our Tuscany tour in September. Again, $250 off per person for first-time travelers. Four spots left on that, and then all our tours are sold out until we figure out maybe we want to do another one. Our May tour, sold out. Are we sold out for October? Sold out. Sold out. So sold out. let's get them all sold out so then we could have lots of people giving lots of memories on this beautiful, beautiful island. I have to tell you, Easter is probably one of my favorite, no, it is my favorite holiday for sure. This period is just so, it's a rebirth, it's so refreshing. Um, <laughs> jelly beans are my favorite. Hint, hint. And you can't really get jelly beans here, huh? Jelly beans, <laughs> jelly beans in Italy stink. I hate to say that. They don't I mean, really have them. Imported jelly beans from Denmark are great, or Norway, or Germany are great, but they fall lag way behind on like marshmallow products. Al, sure. <laughs> that's okay. They have other good things. Yes, they do. Yeah. They do. When you come to Sicily, or even if you go to Rome, or Tuscany, or Florence, take some time, believe me when I tell you this, and people watch, okay? In Sicily, the most obvious place to go, people watching, for inspiration now, is the beach. Because in this hand right here, can hold maybe two or three bathing garments. It's just unbelievable. Now, if that doesn't work, and you like something more cerebral, and not the beach, you can go and watch people at the museum. When they go to a museum, and just take a step back and listen to them explain to their partner what it is they're looking at. If you want to see stuff literally made up on the spot, you need to do that, okay? And that's 
the one thing I want to tell you to do, take some time off and people watch. And I bet you'll come back with just as funny stories doing that as in anything else when you come to Sicily. People watch. Ah, uh, what a life. Thank you for spending this time with us. We want to wish you a very, 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 very happy Palm Sunday, Easter, and uh, happy spring. I hope that for you folks that are li uh, listening in the cold weather climates, I, I hope that the uh, weather warms up, that the snow melts. For those of you in the warm weather climates, especially you snowbirds in Florida, and we have thousands of, uh, of, of people in Florida who, who watch us, uh, uh, I want to make sure that you folks get out of that muggy weather that's going to be about <laughs> coming pretty soon. And uh, God bless you all in Sabanadiga. Ciao. Ciao. Arrivederci. Ching, ching, honey. A lot of orange juice today. Ciao. <laughs>